I'm Jeff Philbin, here to help find fun food to fill you up on a weeknight. Today, we're celebrating all things Florida in more ways than one. First up, I'm making a Florida fusion seafood stew with a coconut twist, plus a simple side of citrus and avocado salad. Our guest today covers all the F's. He's funny, he's Floridian, and he loves his flip phone. If you know who I'm talking about already, then you might be one of his 1.6 million followers on TikTok. And if you haven't heard of him yet, here's a taster. What's going on out here? You ever heard of a Florida sense? It's like a spider sense for Floridians, but it just tingle with some fluttering going on. Flip phone activate. I ain't gonna lie, but I kind of want to do that. I kind of want to get on that next. You know what I'm saying? That's the Floridian in me, y'all. It's the Floridian in me. Only in Florida. I'm just glad I got it on my flip phone. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get on that next. Get your flip phones ready because OMG is Wix, also known as comedian and podcaster Josh Robinson, is with us today in the Dinner Days Kitchen. My friend, welcome Thank here. You. I don't have any sinkholes. I don't have like any alligators. Maybe yet. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Okay, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> but from watching from your videos, we know you and every true Floridian's favorite food. Let's just call it space, babe. It's from Publix. And your love of public is even captured on amazing merch that you actually have on your website. You're literally <laughs> riding a gator with a pub sub. Yeah. I mean, is that not Florida right there? Oh yeah. <laughs> well, our friends at Publix have let us raid their recipe archive to find a dish just for you today, my friend. Really? Which we're gonna take up to the OMG level. Okay. And you may even wanna get the flip phone on standby to grab a snap once we're done. Cause we're gonna have their Mediterranean stew and putting our own little stamp on it. We're gonna take a little bit of grapeseed oil. I wanna just throw in some mushrooms and all of these ingredients, straight from Publix. They were, they were right there for it there, about. which is good. Now, do you do a lot of cooking? Uh, I'm not cooking enough to survive. Enough to survive. Yeah. So what's, what's kind of like the menu at the house then? Um, I make a lot of, you know, pasta. I okay. I do some pasta. I do a lot of seafood because I'm a seafood person, but. Okay. Um, so then this is going to be kind of fun then because we're going to be throwing in some grouper. Okay, I'm you with that. You can't have Florida without grouper That's on that true. one. That is we're going to have some local caught shrimp as well. Okay. So we're going to put oh, I'm that with all that. in there. I'm with that. And all I did was I just added a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of some salt, and okay. a little white pepper. We're going to throw in some fennel. Okay. I love fennel. You like fennel? I like it. Okay. I'm with it. And then we're just going to add just a little bit of some onions. Okay. And some garlic. And you see that white wine over there? Yeah. Let's go ahead and deglaze the pan. Am I gonna do all of it? Just a little bit. About half of that. There we go. That's right perfect. Right, uh -huh. Perfect. And all we wanna just do is we just wanna get this to really cook out some of that wine, give a nice little bit of a flavor, but then also lift up anything that was on the bottom, any of that garlic or any of that onion that was on the bottom. All right. So let's go ahead and add in our ginger paste. All right. Perfect. Now this is really where you're gonna start smelling a lot more flavors. We also have lemongrass. All right, are we doing that one? Oh yeah. All right, let's do it. Oh, that smells so good. Very nice. We also have our red curry paste. You like to cook? Yeah, I mean, I don't know, I, I'm okay at it, but I like to do it. Like, I like the actual trying. It's the I would process. say trying. Okay. I like to try so to that's cook. That's what it's all about. <laughs> yeah. As long as you're having fun in the kitchen, yeah. try something new. Hey, is it gonna be a, a, a slam dunk every time? Maybe, maybe not. I don't yeah, know. You know, mine's more likely than not. I mean, I'm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm more likely gonna mess it up, but yeah. But that's okay. But I'm that's gonna okay. try. That's okay, you're gonna try. <laughs> all right, now, I'm also gonna add a little bit of fish sauce right there as well. How much are we doing? We could go all in on that battle. Oh, here. okay. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. And then I also have here. What you got? What you mild got? salsa. I love the mild salsa. A mild salsa. salsa I dude. love the mild salsa. Like you can't go wrong with that. I, that's my thing. All right, so let's go ahead and add that in. How much? If you could, let's go about half of that. Okay. So what we have here then is just a little bit of some red chilies. This okay. is just red chilies and garlic, and then this. Let's just go with a little bit. Okay. Oh. Perfect. 
to grab the recipe for what we're making today, head on over to Publix.com or for the Jeff and Josh version, DinnerDeals.com is where you want to be. And how do you get there? Well, get your phone. Sadly, not sure this works with a flip phone, but point your camera at the TV and when your phone recognizes the QR code in the corner, a link to us will pop up. All right, chicken bone broth. Both of them? Yeah, we'll do uh, one at a time here. Oh, oh, I knew I was gonna mess something That's up. That's okay. I told you. I got you, I got you. That's perfect. And then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna get the next one as well. So much pressure now. Hey. I messed up the first one. It's all good. <laughs> it's gonna be good till the last drop. <laughs> And all we're gonna do, we're gonna take oh, this up that. right up to a nice boil, and we're just gonna let that be. We're gonna put the lid on top of this so it helps with the time part. Because while that simmers, we're gonna take a quick break. Maybe pop outside, see what's going on there. Maybe catch some wildlife. You I know, don't know. I'm pretty sure there's a gator out there. I'm somewhere. sure we're gonna find something, out, something there. out there. But when we come back, we all know the freshest Florida South starts life in a bag on a public shelf. We're gonna give it the dinner dish treatment. Welcome back to Dinner Diaz. We're in the kitchen today with Josh Robinson, comedian, podcaster, and better known to the world as Florida's finest ambassador on social media as OMG It's Wix. And we're celebrating Florida food with a dish direct from the recipe card carousel of Publix. We're upcycling a seafood stew and a citrus salad. Before the break, we start our Florida fusion stew by heating oil and sauteing mushrooms, fennel, onions, and garlic. Then to glaze the pan with white wine, stir it in salsa, yeah, I know what you're thinking. Trust me, try it. Red curry paste, red chili and garlic, fish sauce, lemongrass paste, and ginger paste. Added in chicken bone broth, brought it to a boil, and now we've just gotta let it be doing its thing. Good. We're just gonna let it simmer here yeah. while we also work on a nice salad. Because, I mean, you kinda gotta do the whole, like, soup, salad thing. Yeah, you have to. It just to. kinda happens that way. It goes together. And, like, I'm not gonna lie. When I was thinking about this whole recipe of, like, all right, hey, you know, what can we do to kinda take it to the next level, too? Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. The Mikado honey ginger salad, yeah. that's like my I favorite like one. one. <laughs> yeah, I like that one. I like that like, one. <laughs> that was, they, there's so much that's going on in this one here. So I'm like, okay, why not we actually have some fun and celebrate it in a yeah. way that, Josh, you get to be a part of this whole thing. And I appreciate that. Well, I appreciate you, my friend. You wanna uh, do a salad dressing? Yeah, let's do it. All right, so what we wanna just do is we wanna just take a little bit of uh, olive oil inside our little. Um, uh, cup here. You trust me to do this? I do. Just a little bit. A little bit more, actually. <laughs> you can go a little bit more. Okay, all right. There we go. Little, all right, there we Perfect. go. Perfect. And then all I did before you got here, I took already from this bag, I took the other ones that we had, the salad dressing out of it. So oh, yeah. all we have here is just that same kind of ginger dressing. Okay. Right there. Just all in there? All in. Okay. Cannonball. I'm an all-in type of person, so. You gotta be, I mean, like, it, how much <laughs> fun is it to see, like, the state of Florida through the eyes like that, where it's just like, cannonball this, cannonball yeah. that type vibe, you know what I mean? Like, it's, Florida's already kind of a fun state to begin with, and like, we've been for years thought about, like, it's just Florida, man, but like, nah, man. No, like, we, we have, we, we got some, I mean, we're normal to us. Yeah. But, you know. <laughs> We're yeah, all in type of state, though. You gotta be all into it. <laughs> all you just did there, too, was you added just a little bit of some garlic, and okay. then here we have just a little bit of some fish sauce. Okay. You wanna help and add in our lime juice? I got you. We're gonna add just a little bit of lime juice. Just a little. Just a little bit, because we just need a little bit oh, of acidity oh. behind that. A and I'm also more? going to, yeah, just a little bit more. Just a little tap splash right there. It's perfect, perfect. We're gonna add just a little bit of some rice wine vinegar. You wanna go with some honey? Yeah, that's, oh. I like honey. You do? Yeah, I love honey. Nice. I got a spoon here if you need it. Oh, okay. See, like that, see, that's how it, that's like the Florida cred right there is like, you know, if someone can say, hey, man, I like I like honey, like Yeah. Do I mean, we go all in? Let's go all in. All right. You said you like honey. I'm, I'm, a, on, I'm going all in with it. I man. love honey. Very cool. Very cool. And then the last ingredient that we're gonna add here is we're just gonna add a little bit more of ginger paste. Do I use the same spoon? Yeah, go right ahead. Oh, we're in there. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're good. We're... Boom. Now, have you played around with an immersion blender yet? Oh, no, not yet. All I'm... right, now this is where you get the Florida card now. This is where it comes okay. into play. Now, now this is where it's all cool because we got all the toys. All you got to do, drop right in, and then just use your finger. Uh -huh. I'll hold it for the oh. And all we want to do is just emulsify it. We just want to bring it all into one. Is it? I think we got it. 
Very good. And we'll just leave that to the side for now. And then... See, in my mind, I had that going everywhere. See, but that's... Like, see, is that one of the reasons why it's, like, intimidating sometimes being in the yeah, kitchen? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. It doesn't have to be. Because I'm like, I don't want to, like... Because in my mind, I'm telling you, it was sauce everywhere. But sometimes that can make for great content. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that is oh, good. Oh, wow. <laughs> Yo, see, and that's the whole thing. You just made that, dude. You just made that. That is good. We're just gonna add a little bit of some green onions and give that a nice little bit of a stir. Because to grab the recipe wow. what we're making today, why not only on the little card in the Publix near the scales? Like, time out. Like, are we are we cool with them taking the scale? I'm away? not cool with it at all. I'm not cool with it either. Like, I got a home scale, but I don't use it. I go to the Publix scale. See, that's where I go for it. That's so. Hey, Publix, we need the scales. So if you haven't taken them away yet. We want them back. Yes. We want them back. Or just send us one. Just send us that. Yes. And while you're doing that, just download the recipe and print it out on our website, dinnerdias.com. You can use your phone to scan the QR code there to find us even faster. All right. So we got our soup base really simmering really nicely over here. Okay. Now, you want to start prepping some of our seafood? I mean, yeah, let's do it. Okay, cool. I'll take that out of your way. Thank you, thank you. Now, let's go ahead and just cut these into nice little nuggets here. We just want to go for about, about an inch by an inch. We're going to go right down the middle. Perfect. Uh -huh. We're gonna just cut right into it. And by the time of this, I don't know if you're gonna be the comedian or the chef after this, dude. Those are good no. cuts. You know, we may have to make a, a transition. I think you're doing good. <laughs> and while you're cutting that, I just added in a little bit of broccoli. And to keep it in tune with what was the, uh, uh, the origin for this dish with this Mediterranean stew, uh, the garbanzo beans. That was an, an item that they had in theirs that I said, I'm going to keep that. I like oh, yeah. that idea. Publix is doing something right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm there every day, so they Are see you me. really? Oh, yeah. Even before make, making content, I was there every day. They know my name. You had, they were down on the first name basis with you. Yeah. Okay. Now, like, when you go for a pub sub, like, what's, what's your pub sub? I got to ask you that part. Oh, so I get the chicken tender sub. Okay. But I get it with... Uh, so I'll have it tossed in barbecue sauce. Okay. I love barbecue sauce. Okay. Um, I get cheddar cheese because to me it melts better because I get it toasted. Okay. Um, I do my garlic pickles. I don't know how this makes sense, but it does. Um, I'll do some lettuce. Uh, sometimes I'll do tomatoes. Okay. But then I'll do like a sub sauce and then I'll do the mayo on the bread. Come on, that dude. Yeah, and it's, it's, it hits every time. They need to name that after you right now, dude. I'm trying to... Like... And you're the first person to get the full, um, my full sub order, so. I'm, I'm digging that I'm already. Like, you, I'm right? in your presence now for that one. Like, I really want to taste that now. The barbecue sauce and the sub sauce together, I don't know why, it's, but it's it, just working? It works. It's every just time. working? Yeah. All right. So while you were slicing up our grouper over there, I added the broccoli and the garbanzo beans. You want to help me with adding in coconut milk? Let's do it. Let's do it? What's the worst that can happen? I, I don't know. We, I mean, it is me, so you just never know. Are you kidding me? I mean, <laughs> now we got a sub afterwards. So if it's not that, hey, we got the sub. No, but I'm telling you, this is going to be absolutely fire. So just... Yeah, go straight into it. Oh, see, I, that's, that was on my mind. It's all good, because I'm going to help break that apart, and we're going to stir that in, while you actually help me with bringing in our lime juice. And we just want to slowly bit. bring... Yeah, because this is really going to just open up really nicely. You can go a little bit more than that. I say, you know my little bit. Because I want to be able to taste that nice little bit of sour behind it and have this juxtaposition of flavors here. A little bit more. Well, let's shake a little bit. Oh, yeah. I was gonna... A little bit more. Okay, Just okay. Just a little bit more. Very good. Killer. Now, we're going to have this come back up to that nice little bit of a simmer that we've had here. And then we can just go ahead. Uh -oh. All we need to start adding in is our grouper. So what our I put going to cook inside this liquid broth. That put is it out on of plate this first. Fantastic. As right. well as our shrimp. Now, do you like shrimp? I love shrimp. You do? Oh, yeah. All right. And so we were able to get from Publix there. We just got some local caught shrimp here. I find a way to get shrimp in every meal that I, I eat. So. Do you really? Oh, yeah. I'll find a way. I kind of knew that. I, I, was, I was just kind of like inside that and just kind of had a feeling. All of it? I mean, it's always, yeah, it's already there. Oh, and now we're just going to let this stir. All these flavors are now going to start to really start to cook our fish as well as that shrimp. Oh, that's... And while well, Josh figures out if he can branch out into recipe videos as well as comedy, we're taking a quick break. But when we come back, we finish up our Florida Feast Ahead on Dinner Diaz.
welcome back to Dinner Diaz. If you return into the TV to take a break from doom scrolling, then sorry, because our guest today is social media superstar and Florida man super fan, Josh Robinson. He's OMG It's Wix. Google him for a good time if you don't know him already. And as a registered Floridian, we're celebrating the Sunshine State with a recipe from Publix, which we've been giving a few twists to. Before the break, we took their bag, honey ginger salad dressing, added olive oil, ginger, lime juice, honey, fish sauce, garlic, and stirred in some chives. Then we diced some grouper and added to our stew along with coconut milk, lime juice and zest, chickpeas, shrimp, and a little bit of broccoli. And that's it. But we also started with that beautiful salad. Now, yes. All right. This right here is going to go straight here yeah. onto our nice bowl. We're just going to put that right in the middle. Now, what I want to make sure that I get is a little bit of height. Okay. And I go all the way through, bring a nice little bit of our orange segment right there because I want to sh let the sunshine state shine. Now. You know. You gotta do it right. You know, just gotta do a little bit of shine. And then they had those wonton crisps in there, which always made for a nice little bit. Yeah. So I'm just gonna put those right on top, just to yeah. give it a nice little bit of some crunch. Oh yeah. A few more green onions on top, like so. And maybe just a couple serrano pepper slices here. And these are already been seeded. That's it. Done. Oh wow. Okay. Done. That, that's perfect. I love that. Now, if you wanted to, you can add a little avocado. Do you like avocado? I love avocado. You do? All right. Oh, yeah. So then what we're going to do is I already sliced up some avocado. I'm just going to put the avocados, just kind of tuck them in. Just going to find little spots here. And all I'm just doing is about half inch slices like you had done with the fish and that grouper from before. Yeah. I'm just going to put that there. It's going to give a nice little bit of creaminess. So okay. with this soup, it's ready. We're going to just bring it over. And this is going to have all those beautiful flavors. And we want to get all that broccoli, those garbanzo beans into this mix. We had those mushrooms. Yeah. To grab the recipes for both these dishes and do them the Jeff and Josh way, head to dinnerds.com where we also have what you need to order to get the OMG It's Wix sub at Publix. All right. How's that look for you? That looks that looks delicious. That that's that's the winner right there. Yeah, that's the winner. All right, so we're going to just add just a little bit of some some lime zest, just because we got to keep it on tune here. Yeah, of course. Got to give it a nice little bit more. We're going to just add a little bit of some cilantro, just on top like so. We're going to add just a little bit of some fresh parsley, just to give it a little bit more green on top. We're going to bring back some of those green onions. A couple of our serrano peppers here. You could have wherever you want to put that. And what I also like to do with the avocado that I had yep. is a nice little bit more oh, that's creaminess perfect. behind it. That's perfect. And I'm putting this just like a little bit on the top, so that way then I still keep it nice and cool. Mm -hmm. So that way when I kind of bring it up with that spoon, it just has a nice little bit of a pot to find there. Look at that. Looks We're taking delicious. another break to see what's on our phones, but when we come back, we'll be putting them down again to go have dinner. Ahead, I'm Dinner Diaz. Welcome back to Dinner Diaz. We've made the most of our local Publix today, taking inspiration from one of their recipes in honor of our guest, Josh Robinson. You probably know him and his flip phone better on social media as OMG It's Wix, celebrating Florida Man and of course Publix. And today he's helped me make a Florida Fusion seafood stew and a Florida citrus avocado salad. You ready to dig oh, in? Oh, I've been excited for this. I've been watching it. Which part did you get into first? The grouper. Broccoli. Mm. Oh, that is good. That is amazing. You did that. I mean, I wouldn't be able to do it without you, so. Well, that's what friends are for, man. Exactly. That's what I'm <laughs> talking about. <laughs> all right. Josh, not only are you all over TikTok and Instagram, but you're also on YouTube with a show called Florida Inc. Yeah. And recently, like, let me get, like, I got to get this straight because <laughs> yeah, I'm, like, yeah. blown away by this one here, my friend. You recently became Florida man when you went python hunting. Oh, yeah. yeah this so this happened. is really you, yeah. and this really happened. Yeah, there's, there's no stunt doubles. This is all me um, just doing some Florida stuff. Florida stuff. <laughs> all right, let's see it. Hell yeah. So here's the male. I got my hand on the female right here. Oh, hell You ready, no. Wake? I'm going to pull this thing out. And he tells me, this one is yours. I say, no, it's not.
Like I told y'all, your boy finally did it. Hell yeah! yeah. <laughs> That's all we're talking about, boys. Your boy did it! Yeah. Yeah. What? <laughs> dude, like, what is going through your head? Like, you, you're... you're it's, it's a python, dude. Yeah, yeah it, was, it was a lot of doubt. Um, it was <laughs> Just more, a little doubt? Yeah, they were like, you can do this. I'm like, no, I, I can't do this. And then they kind of talked me through it. And it was just once you're in there and you commit to it, you just got to do it. Thanks again to Josh Robinson. Follow OMG It's Wits wherever you scroll for content. We have links and the recipes from today's show at our website, dinnerdias.com. And thanks again to our friends at Publix for their recipe inspiration. If you're watching Mr. Publix, we do want those scales back. Yes. Make it happen, okay? Yes. We want the scales back. I'm Jeff Philbin. Thanks for watching, and see you next time from our Dinner Dias. <laughs>